Branvier Singh hereby declare that I will duly fulfil the role of Chancellor and that I will endeavour to maintain and uphold the privileges and rights of the University. I feel quite tingly, uh, it feels quite surreal, but uh, I've got lots of friends and family here and um, it's starting to sink in now um, what an amazing honour it really is to be given this, you know, amazing title of Chancellor of the University. Do you know, I have to say that it took me quite a while to understand why they'd asked me. Um, you know, I'm still, I don't really get it, but there's part of me that understands the power of having a role model from a completely different sort of mould to the ones that, you know, when I was at university, heads of industry or usually white men in their 50s or 60s were chancellors of universities and that's changing and I think it's a really, um, it's a really bold move for the university actually to choose someone who is, I'm going to be 40 this year, who's, who's not quite, you know, uh, middle-aged, but, um, but you know, I'm still working, you know, I'm obviously a northern Indian woman, working class, these are all things that didn't necessarily fit the mould of being a chancellor when I was at university and so um, I think that alone is a strong message. What will Ranveel bring to university? I think lots and lots of different qualities. Um, from the minute I met her, which is only six months ago, I knew that she would combine the whole issue about being a local person, having been educated locally, having been to the university, alongside an outstanding career that's made her a, a national and even international journalist. So the mix I think of our, our locality and the fact that she's made it on the big stage, I think should be great for us. The vision for UCLan over the next five years, both internally and externally, is really a two-pronged strategic approach. One we call the anchor, which is about the economy of, of Lancashire, really, and the country and globally. So it's jobs, good graduate outcomes, helping business startups and helping the economy. The other is civic, and that's helping the community, culture, art, music, and just helping people really get together for the post-Brexit. In five years' time, we expect to be much higher in the league tables than we are today. What are the qualities Mike brings to the university? I think he combines compassion with passion. Often these two things conflict. You can be very, very passionate, but not very compassionate. And Mike seems to bring the two qualities together. He's a very, very open-minded, committed individual. And I think that, again, he's got an outstanding academic background. But in addition to the background, which is very, very important, he brings lots of other human qualities to the role.